Hello everyone, it's the Upform team over here, and today we're just going to go through the process of how to create Google Forms from your iOS device. In this case, we're specifically going to go over how to create Google Forms on your iPhone. Now, as you can see, Google provides a series of apps that allow you direct access to the many platforms where you can create different documents. So in this case, we have a Google Docs app, the Google Slides app. Unfortunately, Google does not provide a Google Forms app. So the first thing you're going to want to do is basically open any sort of internet app or Google app. So in this case, we already have the app for Google itself, and we will simply just have to click that. Now from here, it is a matter of trying to... Now as you can see, we already have Google up. All we have to do at this point is try to access Google Forms website. So what you can do for this is simply look for Google Forms, type it in the search bar, and find the link that will bring you to Google Forms. As you can see, this brought us to the main website, and we want to go to Forms. Don't click Try Forms for Work. We want to head straight to the Forms that is connected to our Google account. As you can see, once we've clicked it, we're immediately brought to this new Google form that we've not actually made before. This is already a new Google form. And from this point, if you want to edit it, it's pretty much similar to how you would edit it on a computer. So if you want to change the title, simply click the title, the description. If you want to change questions, simply click the overarching section and change whatever question form accordingly. If you want to add more questions, as you can see in the bottom, there are options here for you to add more op questions, change the text, you can add a little text box, you can add photos. It's pretty much the same as you would if you were to access it on Google Forms on a computer. And that should be it. Hopefully this helps you better manage your Google Forms and any sort of data collection you might be doing. Be sure to like and subscribe. And if you need any more help with managing Google Forms, check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upper right corner of this video or any of the links right below. See you next time.